Hey, what up, though? You already know where you at and who you rocking with, man. Salute. East side of Detroit in the building. You already know what's going on. Young Goathead, a.k.a. Lord Ogun, a.k.a. Lamagra. Straight up and down, dog. Don't forget to visit www.renegaderevolver.com for your newest merch. You got the hats, the polos, the hoodies over there. You get your newest mixtapes, your hip-hop news. Everything you need, you're going to be able to get if you're a hip-hop head at www.renegaderevolver.com. Hey, now let's get into the content, man. I've been hearing a lot of shit. I've been following this 1090 Jake story, or should I call him Mark? Mr. Cherry, you got some explaining to do, dog, and you're not doing a very good job of talking your way out of this shit. I mean, you're a very good storyteller, man. Show us some of that astute storytelling when it comes down to your situation. I told y'all, I tell my audience all the time, the best way to tell a lie is what? With the truth. You feel me? He just negated a couple factors out of his truth. You heard? That's what, I, that's what I'm seeing. For real. Let's check it out. Let's see who we got in here, man. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? I see the gang in the building. Shout out to the gods. Peace to the 5% nation. The gods of earth. Shout out to my beloved Justice Allah. Piece of shit to a hater. You already know how I get down, dog. The amazing O, looking forward to another great show. And by the way, yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Yes, you already know, homeboy. For real, for real, man. What are you talking about? That go to God. Peace, seven. He say, welcome to Detroit and the whole east side. Man, now y'all already know. When you say that shit to me, it's time for me to say this shit to you. Welcome to Detroit. Motherfucker. Yeah. Were you angry at? Everyone. Everything. What do you do when you get angry? Up on the Fuck my lungs are small. Do you have an outlet to release this anger if you can't get high? No, I don't want to let them release this, this deep fucking hate. Not him for everyone. Everything just a fucking purge. They'll tell you I ain't never been a bitch, nigga. I pop niggas, bitch. I'm really with the shits, nigga. I hit niggas, double barrel to his ass. When that Mossberg hit him, watch a nigga do a dab. These pussy niggas wanna see me dead. Since bottle nine, I'd have had a ticket on my head. I kill shooters, tell that nigga get his bread back. They swim the gang, I send that nigga head back. Whoever said that love begets love was wrong. I'm from a city where blood begets blood. It's love hit niggas mug. That ain't bug and cup. That's choppers for that loose talk. I'm coming plug you up. Pussy, push me. I bet he never see another day. Top at your face. Bet you never see another day. When I get to shooting this motherfucker, get out the way. Zero to a hundred, my baby. It ain't got no delay. Real. You see that? Visit www.renegaderevolver.com, man. Get everything you need over there. Ladies, hip-hop merch. Get you a straight-up uh, fitted cap, a snapback, a hooded, a polo. Get your mixtape. Get the hip-hop news, man. You know, watch a video, dog. Y'all can't see me because I'm under the hat. You heard? Motherfucker. Uh, you put some light in your face. You too dark, blooder. Well, listen, dog. I got to represent. I got to represent, dog. You know what I'm talking about? What's good with y'all, huh? Salute the Renegade Revolver. That's my guy. What's good with y'all, man? Let's see what the comments got to say. Bulletproof love from Brownsville houses, Edgemere Projects, Far Rockaway, Jamaica, Queens, NYC, every day. What's good, five? Listen, dog, I need to... We got to discuss 1090 Jake, man. I've been following this situation. And nothing is more entertaining in the comments in this. In every video you see with dog face on it, talking about him snitching and this and that and the other. Nothing is more comical than the comments, dog. 
How y'all feel about that? Is 1090 Jake a snitch? I mean, he made a lot of money exposing snitches and putting niggas' paperwork out. You know what I'm saying? A lot of money. I wasn't, I wasn't, I wasn't sure how many people he offended until this. Like, not even offended. How many people were offended by what he was doing? Because you couldn't tell. You know what I mean? Everybody was on dog's jock. You feel me? Everybody was on dog jock for a minute there. Like, oh, in the sentence this, and da 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 You know what I mean? So I don't, I don't know. R.I.P. Al Poor Martinez, MJ Tuka, DJ K. Slay, Tupac, and Stan. Legends never die. They are immortalized. And salute to all who lost loved ones to gun violence and natural causes as well, man. Moment of silence. You already know what that means. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, absolutely, man. You already know what it is, bro. I like this, though. I like this little jammy right here, man. You know what I'm saying? Dog got his shit together over there. You know what I'm saying? If anybody else got some merch, they want the God to put on, you know what I'm saying? That day is God day. It's the seventh. Anybody else? Anybody else got some merch they want the God to put out there? You know what I'm saying? A link or something you want me to spam for you? You know what to do, man. Hit my P.O. box and show me what it do, dude. Not what it do, dude. What it do, dude. D-U-D-E. All right. Bulletproof love to the whole chat, the mods, the Purple Heart gang, Cash App gang, the Umbrella gang, and those in attendance. Ghost watchers, hit that like button. Real recognize real. Salute. Shout out to the gang, man. All the members. You say I finally caught the lie. East side checking in, checking in from the east side of Detroit. Backwood coming up. I can't do the backwoods, blood. I gotta do these. This is the best blunt on the market, man. These Savannah leaves can't nothing, man. Can't nothing screw with that. I already got mine put together, man. Every day, every motherfucking day, twice on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. You already know what I'm talking about. Salute, big old, roll up and smoke this fool Detroit style. You already know I got to, man, because listen. Motherfuckers be passionate when it's somebody else's case. You feel me? I don't hear the same passion in dog voice like he trying to beat the, like he trying to beat this, this accusation. I'm going to say accusation even though I know it's black and white. I got the black and white. Shout out to Byron Blake. Shout out to Straight Drop TV, man. I got the black and white. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, it's in black and white. I just want to know how y'all feel about it. Most lawyer, what's good? That go my guy right there with the welcome to Detroit, man. Make sure you stop by if you if you need to, just go to the bottom of the description box. And see that www.renegaderevolver.com right there. You know what I'm saying? Pop that into your Google, because the link might not be working right now. But pop that into your Google search, and the God going to come right up for you. You're going to get what you need to get and see what you need to see. That's my word. They're going to my blood. What up, though? Gang in the building. They're going my sister. Salute. Man, salute the Diva the Boss. Let's talk TV, man. I need all my people. If you're a moderator, and you not, and you, if, especially if you're a moderator, if you're a mod over here, man, you know we support each other. I need you to go ahead over to Diva the Boss Let's Talk TV and subscribe to that thing, man. Man, I was in her chat last night. I put a few messages in the chat. She told her folks, subscribe to my brother channel. Man, damn near everybody in the chat. Ding, subscribe to your brother. Ding, up for debate TV. I just subscribed. Ding, subscribe to your brother. Man, I need her numbers up, man. She need her numbers up, man. We got to get over that 3,000, 3,000 hump. It can be crucial, and y'all can be a crucial part of helping her get over that hump, man. Get over there, like, share, and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Niggas don't agree with everything I do, but y'all still support the kid. You feel me? And I appreciate that. Sis need that same support, so get on over to the boulevard, man, if you a boss. Pull up on the boulevard if you a diva and come on and kick it with Diva the Boss. Let's talk TV, man. Roy, what up, though? How you be, Mr. Pollard? 
Appreciate you, fam. This motherfucker right here, the coldest nigga. I'm one of the coldest niggas doing this shit right there with this. You feel me? Niggas ain't rocking like this. They ain't getting down like this, Revolver. You talking about 1090 Jake, man. 1090 Jake, he made a lot of money on YouTube exposing black folk. You feel me? And, and I'm going to keep it 100 with you since my guy right under your comment, Planet Plainfield. I'm not an avid Charleston white supporter, even though I do agree with some of the shit that he says. Maybe not a lot of the ways he goes about what he does and the shit that he do, but some of the shit he say be accurate. You know, my guy Planet Plainfield, that's his guy. Definitely a snitch. He told, he told on the news. <laughs> this nigga crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. This Charleston White fault. I said it here first. If ain't nobody else told y'all, I'm going to tell y'all right here. This is Charleston White fault. Charleston White called for this white boy to have his chain snatched, somebody to run up and punch him in his shit. He, he, he called for somebody to call 1090 Jake out. And all of a sudden, paperwork start falling out of the sky. Niggas start to turn their back on 1090 Jake. This right here showed me how powerful Charleston White is. Real 100 shit. You might feel differently. That's cool. Shout out to my guy, Chinks Bundle. You know what I'm saying? Chinks Bundle 3.0 Magazine. Chinks Bundles 3.0 Magazine. Salute. One supporter worth a 1,000 subscribers. You always come out supporting. Sometimes I miss the support, but dog, you a real one. Chinks, hey, 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 get over to my guy channel and subscribe too. He also has one. He also has one. Get over to Chinks Bundles. 3.0 magazine, make that happen. Po life in the building. I gotta leave that on the screen for a minute. It's a way of life. They don't understand chinks. They don't understand po life is a way of life, dog. It's a way of life. It's not just the same, dog. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't got that, I don't give a fuck in you. If it ain't stuck in you, like my guy Prodigy said, and you don't even need to be streaming po life. You know what I mean? I ain't talking to you, homie. I'm talking to them, homie. You feel me? Like I said, don't always watch the one in the light. Pay attention to the one holding the light. That's an interesting statement right there, Mr. Lee. I don't know. I've been locked up. I never put no grievance. I never put nobody on grievance. My opinion, dog. That's a kite where I'm from. The word grievance, the word grievance is unfamiliar. As far as the penitentiary go, grievance is some shit you put in at a job. Now, you know, different strokes, different folks, different places and everything else. But you know what I'm saying? That what he did is considered a kite. You feel me? He wrote a kite on dog or this and that and the other where I'm from. He dropped the kite on dog. You feel me? But y'all calling it a grievance. Understood. I ain't never dropped a kite on a nigga neither. I ain't never put a grievance in on a nigga neither. It just is what it is. Don't ask me what happened. Y'all saw that shit. You feel me? Give me my fight ticket. Give me my lockdown. Put me in the hole. Whatever the fuck you're going to do. But I ain't writing no statement behind this shit. You feel me? Dog is a rat. Ain't no way around that shit. I'm tired of people picking and choosing. They like his style. They like that he can tell a story. They familiar with him as a character. The character he is online. Not as of Mark Cherry. You don't know Mark Cherry. You know end of sentence. 1090 Jake. End of sentence. You know what I'm saying? Word is bond. Dog is a rat, man. Flat out and straight up by all accounts. Niggas, any nigga that been to the joint know. What? The number one rule in the joint is no snitching. They're having paperwork parties on the yard and this and that and other. So how you get in the joint and then snitch? And it's cool? No, it's not. That's why he rolled his ass out, dog. That's why he rolled the fuck out. That nigga got out. He did his little, little couple days. He got the fuck out and left the compound because he knew what the fuck he did, man. That boy is a fucking rat. And it's crazy. He, cho he chose to expose him. Like, nigga, this the thing. It's too late. He got a million subs. Even if half of them motherfuckers stop rocking with him, he still got half a million subs that don't give a fuck whether he told or not. Don't give a fuck if he out here doing the same shit that he exposing other motherfuckers for doing or not, homie. It's too late in the game. Niggas got to do their research a little better, yo. 
Dallas, Texas, rocking with you. Shout out, I got man, I got blood down there, man. My bloodline in Texas. You know what I'm saying? Salute to everybody in Texas. Shout out to Dallas. Shout out to Fort Worth, nigga. Shout out to shout out to Beaumont, Texas, nigga. Shout out to Orange County, nigga. You heard? I've been all up and down through that motherfucker, homeboy. Straight up and down, man. He from that other D, Dallas. Shout out to Dallas. No, nah, that ain't good. He know better than that. Or he should. Man, ain't no he should. He knew better than that shit. Straight up. He know better than that shit, dog. My guy say subscribe. Renegade Revolver, salute. That's love. You know what I'm saying? Salute, homie. Andre B, what up, though? Long time no see. Salute, homie. Um, I got a new number. I got to hit you for my new number, homie. I saw you shot me a message or whatnot because my old phone still connected to the, the Wi-Fi at the crib. So when I pop that bitch on to get a number out, I saw your shit pop up or whatnot. I got to hit you up, homeboy. You send me an email or something. You feel me? I'm going to get with you in a minute. That's my word. Chinks Bundle say, I just did. Real. That's real salute, homie. Salute. Um, and to, oh, what up, though, relative? How you be? How you be? That's it. Blood, tell me about 1090 Jake. What you know? I know you know about 1090 Jake. It's supposed to be the big white blood, the biggest white blood in Florida, or the biggest white blood, blood in Boston, or fucking the biggest white blood in the world right now. You got a fucking million subscribers on YouTube. Let me pipe up and fuck my lungs up with smoke, man. Tell me what you think about 1090 Jake, dog. Because I got a little bit of something to say, man. Like I said, I don't watch, dog. Rest in peace, MJ Two Cups. That's the first. MJ Two Cups and motherfucking um, my little brother MJ and 1090 Jake had a relationship. He was trying to get me and dog together at a certain point, but it never wound up coming to fruition. You know what I'm saying? What he doing, what I do is two different lanes. I was not interested in interviewing Dog as I didn't see any celebrity or anything like that. It was really nothing to him. It was just like the cool white kid in the neighborhood that grew up around us. You know what I'm saying? That's what 1090 Jake feel like from a distance. He feel like, you know what I'm saying, the white boy that grew up in the middle of the ghetto and everybody fucked with him. You know what I mean? But I heard he had crashed them. I heard the only reason he's a white blood is because he's a crash dummy for the gang. You know what I'm saying? That's what Dog said. You, you know what I mean? That's Renegade. I promote merch also. Absolutely, she does. Big O, don't 1090 fake look like he be saying, hey, man, stop. Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> hey, man, stop that. Dude, what the fuck? Come on, guys. What are you doing? Yeah, yeah, he, like he says, all oh, that shit, Lawson, Lawson. You're absolutely right. I'm good on them white boys. Lie. I'm a white man. I'm good. I'm good. And them white boys lie. I'm a white man. I know the business. I ain't trying to be disrespectful with the white boy shit. You know what I'm saying? No disrespect, Mr. Pollard. You know what I'm saying? Because niggas lie, too. Flat. You know what I'm saying? Everybody lie. God damn it. Niggas, Chinese, motherfucking Latino. It don't matter what everybody lie. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't trying to be racial or nothing calling him a white boy. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, Charleston White, my nigga. Yeah, Charleston White caused all this shit. Man, Charleston White, the first person I seen take to the web and say, man, fuck 1090J. Straight up. Like, he, I don't know if other motherfuckers did it. They probably did. He the first one I saw say, man, fuck Jake. Why ain't nobody snatched this white boy chain? Why ain't nobody beat the shit out of this white boy? Why ain't none of you gang members and you niggas and nothing like that went up and fucked him up? He all over the place. This nigga went to New York. Shout out to NYC. He was all through NYC, though. You know what I'm saying? And shit, he, he even been, I done seen him in a few different places, though. I ain't gonna front. New York was just the most 
the one I could think of first. Put it like that. Do you paperwork, sir? What what the fuck you mean? What the fuck do you mean, nigga? Lester, what the fuck you talking about, nigga? Do you paperwork, sir? Do you paperwork, sir? What the fuck does that mean? I don't know what the fuck you talking about when you talk like that, man. You better learn how to, what the fuck you talking about this? told on everybody in the fucking jail. He even told his mama. That nigga, why he was telling on everybody in the jail, he told the motherfucking ward, I told my mama. That nigga was telling like a motherfucker. I told my mama. So God damn it, if I'm not goddamn released in a minute, God damn it, it's going to be some furniture moving in this motherfucker. That nigga told everybody. Man. Fuck is y'all talking about? Fuck is he talking about? You got the paperwork, dog. What the fuck is he talking about? Nigga, you told. Nigga, anytime... Listen, dog. Listen, time. Listen, dog. This is the most common way to slice it, man. This is the most common way to slice it, man. Anytime somebody makes themselves the victim, he made himself the victim, and he he said dog name. I was on my bunk. Uh, what what's dog name? Jimmy Hore came into my shit. And hit me in the head. That's telling right there, dog. The motherfuckers know what happened. God damn it. Y'all was fighting. Give me my fight ticket, dog. Give me my fight ticket, dog. You know, that's about it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you got anything to say? No. I ain't got shit to say. When you get into who started what and who did this and who did that, oh, you telling, homie. Nigga, you told on dog. You told on, 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 on the police. You know what I'm saying? You told your mama. Nigga, you told on the bloods. You said the bloods told you to lay there. This is 1090J. He said the bloods told him to lay there and play like a victim so he wouldn't get moved out of the fucking unit. Come on, man. How we know that? Because he told us. That's how the fuck we know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's real 100 shit, dog. A jailhouse rat might be even worse than one on the streets, dog. A jailhouse rat may be even worse than one on the street, dog. That's real 100 shit. That's why I said the comments made me make this video. I'm reading the comments over there and niggas is taking his side. It ain't no, it ain't telling when you tell on the police and all this other shit and they just finding ways to take his side and say he ain't this, he ain't that. And I'm just trying to figure out why all you niggas love this boy so much like that. You know what I'm saying? Let's see. Let's see. I, let me get up here. Let me get up here in these comments, man. Let me get up here. Let me get up here. Where we at? 
I got another clip with me, man. I got a clip of Doggy Toad on talking about it. Um, Charleston White out here spraying motherfuckers with mace like Ray on the road. Absolutely. He fucking niggas up, too. He is fucking niggas up, man. I ain't gonna front. I got you, Deb. Yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. Dropping a slip is like dry snitching in jail. Facts, my nigga. That's an absolute motherfucking fact. That shit'll get your cell raided. That'll get you rolled up out that bitch. Man, anything. That's an absolute fact, homeboy. Here's my thing. The police got to be on some shit. Because how is everybody fucking paperwork and goddamn CI slips and all this shit all of a sudden being released? Man, the Chicago police got a channel on YouTube right now where all the homicides that's on solve that they got on camera go. They don't show the nigga actually getting popped, but they show the nigga pull it and pop it. They don't show him hitting nobody. Then they show him on his way out, running out and everything. Out. I'm like, wow, Chicago wilding with this shit. The police department. It make you wonder, man, is this population control for real, man? I just watched a clip of Condoleezza Rice saying, when we practice uh, good habits, clean air, and population control, the world can turn around and this and that and the other. Is, is this a form of population control? Jacob Cherry. Jacob Cherry. Jacob Cherry. It must be Mark Lewis then. I might have. Jacob is my cousin. Your cousin is a rat, boy. Like that nigga that be on YouTube. Can, can you get that off the top shelf for me there, boy? Your cousin a rat there, boy. How about that? He fucking told. <clears throat> Ain't no way around it. Then I watched the motherfucking video on Instagram and him talking about you got to make it sound good for the, for the warden and shit so they can let you out. Man, get the fuck out of here, nigga. You ain't got to say shit. Do your little punk ass 60 days, nigga. My man did four months in that bitch and got deported off what 1090 Jake did, dog. He did four months in that motherfucker and got deported, dog. He said he got one year left before he can come back. Jake is old slang for a cop. That almost was my thumbnail. 1090 Jake is a Jake. Is 1090 Jake the Jake's word? You absolutely right, homeboy. That is old slang for a cop, dog. Themselves, I agree. A rodent. We on you tonight, 1090 bitch. <laughs> it's a fact, though. It's a fact, man, and niggas just love to see act a fool on other niggas, though. You know what I'm saying? Call up. Niggas is even asking him is this snitching. Who made him the motherfucking police? Well, I guess he made himself the police. No pun intended. I wasn't even thinking of saying that joke, but it just happened. But who made him the motherfucking snitching police? Talking about motherfuckers that sent him Bimmy shit and ain't this and that and the Bimmy shit ain't this and that and the other. Motherfuckers just take his word for it, dog. Just take his word for it, because he did a little time. He got a nice following. Y'all like the way he tell a story? That don't make that shit what Chinks Bundles Magazine just said right there. It don't make it facts. Fact of the matter is, your paperwork just came out, son. Dun, 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 dun. What's what's dog name? Zo baby said the the nigga so baby the nigga Zo baby says that he was a crash dummy for the gangs, man. For 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 basically the black gang members. You know what I'm saying? Have you ever seen a white gang member around him? He didn't been on no jumper. He didn't been on a couple of things. You know what I'm saying? He been on a couple different podcasts and shit. Have you ever seen a white gang member around him? <laughs> 
So he ain't with us down here. We ain't playing with that boot. That's what I'm saying, dog. That's what I'm saying, dog. And a lot of niggas just like, oh man, 1090 Jake did this. Not 1090 Jake said this. 1090 Jake said that. The paperwork he told in front of everybody. The fuck you mean? Right on, dog. You said it ain't my organization, but that's a lot. What what organization is that? I'd like to know what organization that is. Mr. Pollo, what we talking about? I'm a little bit lost. You said it ain't my organization, but that's a lie. What I lie about? White boys can't be blood shit in the paperwork. I don't know why they letting him jack that. It all depends on what set. I don't know what set he is. I don't know what set he is. You know what I'm saying? I know plenty of white Latin counts. Latin, Latin kings, not counts. I know plenty of uh, plenty of white Latin kings, dog. I know some white vice lords. You know what I'm saying? I know a high-ranking white vice lord. I was just about to say his name, but that would be snitching. <laughs> Straight up. So it all, <coughs> it all depend on what, what or <coughs> wait. Every day. Every motherfucking day, nigga. Twice on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. That nigga Jake was in jail on that Tusi shit. I'm on the stage right now, singing your favorite song. Look in the crowd, they know where you is gone. I say your ass went to the hole because you hit me with that fucking pole. Why did you hit me with the lock? Why did you put that in the sock? Why did you grab that rock? Why did you make it go bop right on top of my top? Why did you hit me stop? Stop that what you doing. Police come and ruin what you was doing. Somebody that can hit you with the lock, that lock that's in the sock. But you think I'm a good brother? What organization are you talking about, Mr. Pollard? I'm quite confused here. I don't think he grew up around none of that shit, because I did. No, I'm not like that. OK, I'm confused all the way. I think he's just lying. Word, it's not a racist thing. It's a rat thing. You know what I'm saying? It ain't even a rat thing for me because I don't give a fuck who he told on. You feel me? My thing is ripping the mask off these niggas, dog. You feel me? I ain't going to say he act like this or act like that. He act like himself. Motherfuckers trying to say he act black. He a culture vulture or all that other shit. Man, I'm not saying none of that shit. The boy himself, nigga, but be yourself. Be who you is, nigga. You out here under the guise of this and that and the other, knowing goddamn well you got the same shit in your jacket somewhere. I said somewhere because I guess he stood tall on the charges he had, as often a lot of men do, because they ain't got no fucking body to tell on. Ain't no co-defendant. You know what I'm saying? If it was, a lot of these so-called stand-up niggas I have a motherfucking asterisk by their name. You heard? Because he the police. I grew up in South Boston with those racist Irish people. He didn't grow up in Roxbury or Orchard Park projects. Man, I couldn't tell you would know better than me, homie. Dots 357 saying, be more, it's a violation to drop a slip even in a medical box without fellow members checking what you read. Facts, nigga. You talking gang activity facts, my nigga. It's a violation.
damn rap in jail lets you know he been telling out here in the free world. See, he, he, he a good storyteller, ain't he? That's what grabbed my attention. What's up, y'all? You rocking with me? I'm rocking with y'all. 1090 Jake. Let's get into the content. <laughs> Dog got his, he got his little routine and shit. You know what I'm saying? Then the fucking video dropped and shit. He's a good narrator. He can narrate the shit out of the story. You know what I'm saying? So that lets you know he can narrate. I agree, but I just don't feel like you should put anybody's name in anything. That's me. Facts. Never seen or heard of a white blood or a white Latin king, and I lived in Los Angeles for almost seven years in the 2000s and Chicago as well. Well, you already know how that shit happens, man. Like, See, I, a lot of the gang culture in the D came from Chicago, along with Detroit's own gang culture. Detroit got its own gang culture. You feel me? But at a certain point, that folks, that people's nation, that shit spread to Detroit like a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? A lot of shit became about up or down. You know what I'm saying? Versus red and blue. You know what I mean? So it, 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 at one point, <clears throat> she got all crazy. Let's just put it like that. She got all crazy. So like I said, dog, um, <clears throat> yeah, I know some white Latin kings, man, a few of them. I also know a pretty high-ranking member of a different organization. Like I said, that's a white boy. Man, that's some bullshit. You trying to get me to read that shit? See, you you, you know what I'm saying? If that's how you feel, that's how you feel. I ain't reading that shit, though. I feel like that's a planted comment. You plant that comment to me, for me, for me to read your shit so somebody can clip that shit and just listen to me saying the shit that's across your screen. <laughs> you feel me? I just seen Mac Mean in here. You feel he said some some shit similar to this. This probably his his rogue account right here or whatnot, trying to get me to read that bullshit you out your shit, yo. <laughs> yeah, that shit was what the fuck is that? What the fuck? That's training day. You shot me in the ass, Jay. I'm gonna grab this gun and I'm gonna grab that money. I know some white vice lords and some G, but I ain't never seen the white blood. Not nowhere I'm from, I never seen it. That's what he rep G Shine. Ain't that what Melly rap? The Melly nigga that just got acquitted or just got hung jury or something. He just got a hung jury or something. I think that's what Melly rep. And that's another thing. He's supposed to be part of Melly's Melly trial or some shit like that. Like, I don't know what the fuck. He was in the paperwork or something. He was proud of being in the paperwork at Melly's murder trial. Keep watching. What's good with you, homie? How you be? Salute. Basil Champ alumni. What's good with you, homie?
Miss Robinson, what you mean they showing the kids their heroes? <clears throat> Say, I don't know how personally them dumb moves could let him get away with that, in my opinion. Well, <clears throat> do you kill the golden goose? Man, they was all on 1090 Jake with him. You know what I'm saying? Members. Members was all on, not on 1090 Jake. They was all on a couple things. When he went to New York, they was all with him. And it's not other. You don't kill the golden goose. You protect him. He ain't back. I don't know. He said he got three years. Some, 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 man. Let me see, dog. You said he got another year or so to do. And then he, he can, I guess, apply for his citizenship or come back to the United States. That's a good question, Mr. Miller. You know, because of that shit, you feel me? That was one of the reasons why, you feel me, why I got, I went to see him and got and did 120 days. Because then so he it, snitched on me. So it penalized you in a way? They, they say it was no consequence for you, for him doing what he did. That's what they paid him. There was no consequence. Nah, man. That nigga, that nigga fucked up, man. That nigga snitched. Dog right there. Straight out, uh, shout out to Straight Drop. That's what he, he got the interview with dog. Dog say, no, nah, that nigga snitched, dog. Ain't no way around it. You know what I'm saying? So yo, Lester got the fuck out of here. John Davis, U.S. John Davis, email us your real ID. I don't, however, think, I don't, however, thing is all over the place, but all I'm saying a lot, all I'm saying, I've never seen the white blood where I'm from. That's all I'm saying. I don't know how it is in other states, but in Dallas, I could dig it. So that's a profound perspective. Let me see what he say. Tied with a few white dime moves. That's not about the set. It's the heart of that white boy. Politics are different in the pen. Which car is he riding with? When shit get active, white or black dime move. Word. I don't how oh I already read that one. Well, I don't know. Like I say, me personally, following what was going on and looking at the whole shit. I found it funny how many people made an excuse 
for what was done. Oh, it ain't this. The lightest one was, uh, what y'all call it? That's a grievance. The nigga can't get in trouble for that. This and that the other dog just told you. He did four months and likely was deported behind that shit because ICE check everything. He said ICE check everything. They check your motherfucking prison shit and everything else when you come out that motherfucker to see how you was doing or what you was doing when you was in that motherfucker. And spending four months in the box don't stand out. Dog say he did 120 days. And here's another thing, man. It all depends on who. I mean, the paperwork is what it is, but homeboy said he got down on Jake and to his banger, basically, or whatnot. So they, they didn't even have his banger or what they called Jake woofing up or something he called it. Like, you know, he said the nigga would be acting fool or some shit like that. They caught him doing that shit. And that's how they got hip to the whole situation. No, ain't nobody. I know. I, shit, everybody got their own opinion. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. My thing is, if he's a white blood, who's his enemies? Blacks? And that's why I don't agree with other races joining different organizations. Interesting. That's interesting. That's interesting. Like I say, the idea of gangs can be traced back to or organizations or whatever you want to call it can be traced back. Man, further than I can think. Same with Mexicans banging black sets. Which car you rolling in? Blacks, Southern or Northern? And vice versa. With blacks banging they, they set or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> as far as that goes with the Latino. Well, shit, that's my time, folks. I ain't got much more to say on the subject. I just want to gauge my audience's mental about the situation and see where y'all was at with it because like I said I watched it for a day or two and I'm like man it's crazy but like I it, it was surprising to see how many YouTubers were well I say are offended by what he does you know what I'm saying because you wouldn't think that it would be I, I don't see a lot of hate videos on 1090 like I said Charleston was the only one that I seen call for war against 1090J and it looked like it worked you know what I'm saying Man, I don't know the way the world is today, man. You know what I'm saying? He might have been there already. He might have been there already, dog. Because you think about this social media world we live in, man. You know what I mean? And a nigga trying to piggyback that audience. You feel me? His audience. So they would accept him with arms wide open. I didn't understand the New York shit till I got some inside information on him being able to travel around New York City so safely. You know what I mean? <clears throat> and about what you know, it's who you know sometimes. And what you do. Where Black's doing it too. I knew Black Latin Kings. I don't agree with that either. Right, it ain't about judging. Like I said, I don't give a fuck what he did and who he did it to. You know what I mean? 
she said, I don't know, but I ain't got to judge. I'm going to end it on that. Maybe he legit. I don't know. I can't judge nobody, but I know if you put somebody's name in a grievance or a report, you know what I'm saying? I don't know that man. I don't know what you mean by that last line. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. I know what you mean by that last line. You know what I'm saying? It's a, it's a rap. Shit, don't talk to me no more. <laughs> That's the only way I can take that. You know what I mean? Don't talk to me no more. I don't fuck with him. Oh, shit, my line's playing. That was a great comment, Basil Champ. That was a great comment, dog. What channel are they on, man? Um, oh, yeah, I'm about to get out of here, dog. <laughs> Let me see what these lines doing. Well, I ain't doing shit yet. I ain't playing yet. Oh yeah, they just about what they doing? They kicked off. Who y'all got tonight, man? Playing the playing field. I seen what you said there, dog. Who y'all got tonight? The Chiefs or the Lions, man? That nigga said we getting slaughtered tonight? Hell no, nah, we ain't getting slaughtered tonight. You tripping. We ain't getting slaughtered tonight, dog. 815, what time they tip off? That's what's up. Yeah, tonight against the Chiefs. NBC. All that good information where you can check the Lions out kicking ass. We about to kick some ass tonight, dog. Oh, yeah. I got to put your comment up because you said that, man. <clears throat> I'm going to see you in the chat again, and we're going to talk about it straight up. No negative energy. We talking Detroit. You say the Chiefs gonna kill them? Oh man, no, no, no negative energy, dog. No negative energy, dog. I'm acting like I ain't see that. That's what I saw. Lost and lost and say Detroit. My nigga playing playing field say Lions. He don't know shit about football, man. That don't make it no better, man. Just get that positive energy flowing through there, dog. The Lions gonna do this. You know what I mean? We're going to do this. I don't know why they always fuck with us like that. They give us the hardest shit. Like, the first part of our season be hard as a motherfucker, man. One national game and fucking eight hard-ass games in a row. Who they got next? The Ravens or some shit? I think we got the Ravens, the Bears. That shit crazy, man. You won't give us the fucking defending national champs the first night of the season, do you? Under the big bright lights on, <laughs> on NBC. That's fucked up. But dig, man, I'm about to get out of here and check this game out, man. Salute to everybody that came through. Salute to your opinion, whether you agree or disagree. This is just what I think, dog. You know what I'm saying? I'll be back next time. Salute.
tell you I ain't never been a bitch, nigga I pop niggas, bitch, I'm really with the shits, nigga I hit niggas, double barrel to his abs When that Mossberg hit him, watch a nigga do a dab These pussy niggas wanna see me dead Since bottle nine, I done had a ticket on my head I kill shooters, tell that nigga get his bread back Hey, swim the gang, I send that nigga head back Whoever said that love begets love was wrong I'm from a city where blood begets blood It's love to the niggas mug That ain't bugs and cups That's choppers for that loose talk I'm coming plug you up Pussy, push me I bet he never see another day Top at your face Bet you 